from the time chat gpt came in market multiple different companies also started building llm models while they were already in process to build those they started revealing their models to end customers recently one chinese startup deepseek also rattled this entire market now today i'm going to talk about a new tool which has been now introduced by another big giant alibaba so they have introduced quen is another llm model and currently it's absolutely available for free let me show you in this video how can you use alibaba's quen and can it be a replacement of chat gpt or any other llm models which you are using on daily basis currently i'm in google home page and if i paste this particular link you will be able to see this particular interface now here you can start working but i would suggest you you create your id and then you log in what i'll do i'll click on login i already have my id created using google login what i'll do i'll click on continue with google and then i'll select the id where i have the access so i have selected my id where i was already started using this particular tool you can also use in the similar way or you can create a separate email id to log in in this particular tool also so currently it's verifying my login and now i'm logged in and i can see my chat histories also so this is same interface the way you see chat gpt or any other llm models but there are few of the good additional features are available in this tool let me show you one by one first of all let me show you few of the settings here if i go to my profile picture and i click on settings under general there are normal things but if you go to interface you will be able to see few of the options let me zoom it in a bit you can see one very good option that is auto copy response to clipboard normally what we do whenever we use any of the llm model sometime we copy those text whatever are getting generated and we use it elsewhere right you can enable this particular option so it will get automatically copied to your clipboard so if you have any type of scenario you can use this feature few other features are also there which you can evaluate like title auto generation like whenever you are starting a new chat it will create titles like this way automatically so that also you can enable or disable and few other options are there but i found this auto copy option to clipboard is very very useful if i just show you few more things here one is model you will be able to choose between multiple different models and those details are available here if you read this particular text in case you use quen 2.5 max how it will help like mathematical problem coding role playing in those areas this model will work better similar way if you want to use the plus version what are the other capabilities are there so you can spend some time and check about this availability of capabilities among different models and whenever you will be using this tool you will be able to use those features you can check other options also by clicking here and those are self explanatory you will be able to understand easily so if i close this particular option then i come back let me show you few other options and how can you use those features one feature i'm going to show you now that is very good and that's not available in this way in other tools that is on the image generation if i click on image generation then you will be able to see multiple different options if you go here and click on this option that is use prompt you will be able to use this prompt if i do it here if i click on this particular prompt you can see this is already using that prompt and it is generating a different version of the same type of image for me you can see it generated a separate image altogether from the same tool itself now if i come here again if you see another option is there that is in this drop down that is size of your image so you will be able to define a size whenever you are generating any of the images so if i go to a new chat and there i use this particular prompt using which i generated one image earlier earlier i copied this prompt from mid journey if i click on image generation and then i select 16 is to 9 and then i click on this send message it will generate that image for me in 16 is to 9 ratio so till date when i am using chat gpt to generate my youtube thumbnails there specifically i need to mention please generate a 16 is to 9 thumbnail and that's the way it's get generated look at the image quality if i just click on it you will be able to see again i if i click on download then this image will get downloaded you can see it's a 1.2 mb file and if i double click this particular png file you will be able to understand the quality it generated look at this quality look at the texture of this food so i'm already feeling hungry watching this particular photo so this is the way you will be able to use the feature of image generation using this alibaba quen tool which is now becoming a very prominent one in the market
Now, if I go back to this uh, one new chat, currently it's showing that video generation is coming soon, but it was available for me last week itself. If I come here and I click on this option, rainy day puppy walk, then you can see this video it generated on that time. I just used one prompt, a golden retriever puppy walking in streets of Kolkata with his owner on a rainy day. And it generated this five seconds video. You can see how it generated. I know there are different areas it can improve, like the text are not up to the mark, or this is not a Kolkata street. Kolkata streets are in different way. This is somewhere outside India. But if I just play, you will be able to see a free tool which is generating video while it's having some improvement areas, but it was able to generate. But now it is not allowing. So what I'll do, I'll publish a different video altogether once this particular option will be again available, then I'll record a one detailed video covering the entire topic. Now, other options are more or less same. If you want to select any specific model from here, you can click on this drop down and you'll be able to find out the actual model which you need to use. You can go to the settings uh, which I shown earlier and in the model to understand which model you should be using for which purpose, you will get an idea from here. So that you can check. But net net, I want to introduce this particular tool with all of you so that you have another option. Instead of paying $20 per month to open AI, you can get some of the work done by this tool also. And specifically on the image generation, it's doing a fabulous job that you can also use for. Let me know in the comments below, what do you think about this tool? The image generation part specifically, will it be useful or not useful or any other feature you want me to evaluate in this channel? Recently, I also published some of the videos. How can you avoid paying $20 per month to OpenAI? And what are the other alternatives are available with us? You can check this video, which can be another option for you, which you can evaluate.